CBS Young and the Restless Spoilers, when news of the horrific fire at the prison where Jordan was detained spread throughout Genoa City, Victor Newman did not hesitate to mobilize the entire police force in search of the rubble. In his heart, a strong suspicion had formed. Was this a plot by Jordan to escape? Victor, who always trusted his intuition and experience, asked the police to test the DNA of all the bodies found in the fire, hoping to find clues about Jordan. This is not easy because the number of victims and the level of damage from the fire are very large. Each DNA sample is carefully collected and sent to the laboratory for analysis. Chance Chancellor, who believes in Victor's theory, decides to participate in this quest. He knows that Jordan's a dangerous prisoner, and if she really has escaped, it means a great threat, not only to the Newman family, but to the whole city. Meanwhile, the other members of the Newman family are living in constant anxiety and fear. They don't know if Jordan really died in the fire or if she's hiding somewhere, ready to carry out her revenge plan. The big question is, did Jordan really die in the fire, or was it just an elaborate move in her escape plan? And if she's still alive, can Victor and the police force find to stop her before it's too late? Victor, in a tense and determined mood, constantly monitors every progress of the investigation. He knows that any information, no matter how small, could be the key to unlocking the mystery of Jordan and her plans. The search for Jordan became one of the most notable cases in Genoa City's history, with both police and powerful figures involved. Every step, every clue is closely watched as Victor and Chance work together to solve this mystery, not only to protect the Newman family, but to keep the community safe. In the tense and dangerous environment that Jordan creates, Victor Newman realizes that he must do everything he can to protect his family. Aware of the immediate threat to Nikki, Claire, and Victoria, Victor made an urgent decision. Ask Nikki to leave Genoa City immediately. He wanted her safe, out of Jordan's reach, and London was an ideal destination, where she could work well away from the enemy's pursuit. Victor also put strict protective measures in place for Claire and Victoria. He knows that Jordan is not only smart and cunning, but also very dangerous. There's nothing that can stop her if she decides to target someone. Victor arranged tight security measures, including personal bodyguards and a constant surveillance system, to ensure his family's absolute safety. Meanwhile, Nikki, although worried about the situation, also understood that it was necessary for her to leave. She knew that by doing this, she would not only protect herself, but also reduce the burden and worry for Victor and his family. Nikki prepares for her trip, but can't help but worry about what might happen while she's not there. Meanwhile, Victoria and Claire, despite being heavily guarded, also feel the growing danger. Not only do they fear for their personal safety, but they also worry about other loved ones in the family. Every step, every decision they made was carefully considered, knowing that Jordan was probably watching their every move.